Evening right back to you guys. So what students were telling me today is that while they were disappointed, they were just glad to be graduating. Some agreed that due to these recent events, it seemed like the smartest decision. While students took graduation photographs under the Emory Iron Arches, as so many have done so before them, they were faced with the reality that they won't be participating in another decades old tradition. I woke up this morning reading the email and maybe felt a little disappointed, but um, I'm just really glad that I'll still be able to graduate with my cohort. Earlier Monday, Emory's president announced this year's graduation would be moved to Gas South Arena in Gwinnett County due to security concerns following recent protests on campus. Writing, know that this decision was not taken lightly. It was made in close consultation with the Emory Police Department, advisors and other agencies. Some students admitting they understood the decision. It was a little surprising, but honestly, I think it makes sense. It's probably the safest option for this school just to keep things a little bit calmed down. The move comes after 28 people were arrested on Emory's campus after protests on the quad turned violent. Emory's graduation has taken place on that very quad for the past four decades. We are just days now away from that graduation. It will be held next Monday, May 13th. And during a town hall today, Emory's president revealed that he and officials on campus are working on a transportation option to get these students to and from the venue. For now, reporting live from Emory's campus, Brittany Kleinpeter, 11 Alive News.